remember what the haters talking about. What's up, family? Comedian Dion Cole recently attended an NAACP red carpet event, and he wore a rather unusual outfit. Well, it's unusual in the sense that it's not the type of thing that people wear today. This was a blast from the past. A bell-bottom velour jumpsuit. This is something that people in the back in the day used to wear. My daddy, I believe, had at least one bell-bottom jumpsuit. And your daddy did too. And some of your granddaddies was probably wearing bell-bottom jumpsuits. In any event, fast forward. A number of people took exception to Dion's outfit. They didn't like it. One person went as far as going inside of his inbox and calling him a gay ass N-word. Almost said the word. So, I guess Dion got fed up with it and he decided he wanted to address it. It had to be heavy on his mind because he made a 15-minute video on IG addressing it. He said, you know, I've always had the balls to wear whatever I wanted to wear and push the envelope. Uh, sometimes, you know, most of the times I get best dress. Uh, every now and then, you know, he said, uh, I think he said he had a worse dress once. But, you know, he's like, I'm always trying out new stuff, you know, with my outfits. And, you know, it's part of who I am. And he said, you know, yeah, everybody has their opinion about what they like, and that's cool. You're not supposed to like everything everybody like, and you're entitled to your opinion. He said what got him was not that people didn't like the outfit. He said what got him was the hatred that was aimed at him. A number of celebrities chimed in on Dion's outfit including Marlon Wayans and Snoop Dogg, who he went back and forth with. Now, here's the way I see this whole dress code thing. What goes around comes around. I didn't really think that much of the bell-bottom outfit because I've seen it before. You know, I saw it in the 70s, and I just thought it was a fad. I did not think it was that bad, especially considering what some of these dudes are wearing to echo Dion's sentiments. Like he was like, even some ladies were calling him gay and calling him out of his name. And he's like, wait a minute, ladies. Y'all like these dudes running around here in these skinny jeans, these skinny, 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 skinny jeans. But y'all got a problem with a man wearing some bell bottoms? Y'all got a Y'all like these dudes with their pants hanging off their ass, with their drawers showing and booty cracks showing, but they're, they're not gay. But the guy with the bell bottoms is. Help me understand it, family. Ladies, please chime in on this. I need you. Help me out. Help me understand how these women could be so opposed to a dude wearing bell bottoms which again was at one time very much in style, very much part of black culture. They can be opposed to that, but they're cool with dudes wearing jeans tighter than they wear the jeans. They're cool with dudes walking around with their ass crack showing. Help me make sense of that. Now, bell bottoms to me, it wasn't like one of the best eras of uh, or the best styles that trended. I don't think it was one of the best. Nevertheless, I never looked at it like it was one of the worst. It reminds me of 
you know, you know the, the platform shoes. Remember that? If a dude wore platform shoes today, he would definitely get called out. The platform shoes and the, the bell bottoms, the zook suits and all of that type of stuff. What tripped me out is that I didn't really pay too much attention to it growing up. If the dudes today wore what some of those dudes had on back in the day, oh man, and we ain't gonna even start with Prince. Now, I see a dude wearing some of that stuff that Prince wore, oh yeah, I'm gonna automatically assume that that's what's up. I'm, I'm, I ain't no way, I'm, I'm not gonna give you the benefit of doubt. Strangely enough, I gave it to Prince. How did that happen? Was I in denial that I loved the music that much that I just didn't want to think about it like that? But here's the thing also, though. I knew Prince, and I've never known Prince to not like women. I've never known Prince to be attracted to dudes. I've never seen him in that way, and I've been around him several times. Uh, Prince has never, like, his actions, now his outfits are questionable, but... His actions, Prince was very much, in, very much into women, like, and not men at all. Men, boys, none of that time. That, couldn't put that on Prince, not at all. He was not built like that. But he did not mind wearing women's clothes. Some people say, well, what's women's clothes? I mean, people should be able to wear what they want to wear. That's true. But if you step out there, you got to be prepared to get called out. Again, I don't think that Dion stepped out there and crossed the line. I think he stepped out there, but I don't think he crossed the line. Again, we've already been there where not only celebrities were wearing bell bottoms, but damn near every black male was wearing bell bottoms. Unlike today where you got a lot of these dudes wearing skinny jeans and many black men have made it a point to be adamantly opposed to wearing skinny jeans. But what say you? Did Dion go too far? Drop a comment. No more talk. What the talking about?